So the new Zombies map Malda Toten is now out for Black Ops Cold War and here I'll show you how to turn on the pack a punch machine to pack a punch your weapon as easily as possible. If you're interested in any other videos like how to turn on the power or anything else like that then feel free to check out those videos there'll be a playlist for that with a card on screen or a link in the description to any of those videos or that specific playlist. But without further ado let's get into this guide on how to pack a punch your weapon in the new Zombies map. So the first step you want to take is to turn on the power and this is how you do it. So you start on the rooftop of the fifth floor apartments and what you want to do is get some kills to earn enough essence to buy the first door on the roof to access the zip line and travel across to the destroyed penthouse. You then want to get more kills to be able to buy the door allowing you to use the zip line to the Corba rooftop. Following this you want to run downstairs past the garment factory and the factory staircase to the alley on the ground floor. Now once you're on the East Berlin streets you want to head towards the bar with a yellow neon sign and go through the door towards the back of the bar which will bring you through to an electrical store. Now here there'll be a tempest that spawns, basically like an electrical enemy and ideally you will have cleared out most of the enemies before this point so that once it spawns you can keep shooting it and dodging its attacks easily to take it down and then when it dies it will drop a fuse collectible part, you need to pick this up and this will be one of the two fuses that you need. You can keep track of this by looking at the power tab in the menu by pressing the middle button on your controller. You then want to head back onto the East Berlin Street and down towards the underground station indicated by the purple neon U sign which you can see above it. So once you're downstairs in the ghost station head across the tracks Make sure not to be hit by any of the trains obviously because they'll keep coming past and you want to run past mule kick into the switch control room and then into the maintenance tunnel. When you get to the maintenance tunnel turn left to enter the power room and head across to the panel with the power switch on it. Now once you flip the switch you'll think the power will turn on but it will actually fail to turn on properly and there'll be someone speaking who will tell you to find another fuse. So we've got the first one and now we just need the second one so you need to head to the back of the power room and down to the sewer access and here you'll find another tempest you need to kill and once you do it it will drop another fuse you need to pick up so do that and then you have both of the fuses you then want to head back to the power terminal and place both fuses which will allow you to turn on the power by flipping the switch and then you have the power on obviously if you get lost at any point there'll be purple arrows along the way to tell you where power is but if not it seems fairly straightforward all these points so once you've turned on the power you now want to follow step two which is to activate the pack-a-punch machine. So from the sewer access room where you just killed the second tempest, turn right to head under the arch and then on your left will be the rope which you can repel up and this will bring you to the West Berlin streets. Now when you're here you want to come out of that little alleyway and turn right to walk over the pile of cars and past an American flag which is also known as Checkpoint Charlie. And then straight ahead will be the pack-a-punch machine surrounded by a bunch of floating dead enemies. You want to then hold square or X to interact with the pack punch machine which allows you to use the machine by confronting the dark ether to prove you are worthy. What this means is that it will cause all the enemies surrounding that pack punch machine to drop and attack you so obviously this means you want to try and take out any spare zombies before this point so you can start the ritual without too much difficulty. I don't think I did this but I recommend taking out most of the zombies first. So once you interact with the pack punch machine and the zombies drop, kill all of the zombies that dropped and then you'll have to defeat an enemy with a skull face known as the Disciple. So it's handy to have a ring of fire or something so that you can activate that field upgrade to kill this enemy as easily as possible. So try and have a ring of fire saved up for this. It might be easy to take out the Disciple and also all those other zombies a lot more easily. But then once you've killed them all and you have at least 5,000 points, you can use the pack a punch machine to upgrade your weapons and then hopefully you can get onto some really high games in Malda Toten. So that's how to pack a punch in this new zombies map. If you need any other guides like getting the wonder weapon or anything like that, feel free to check out my guides. There'll be a playlist for that. Like I say, a card on screen and a link in the description. I've also got guides on how to unlock the flawless Ethereum crystals if you need to upgrade any perks or weapon categories or ammo or anything like that. But thanks for watching. Hope you found it useful and I'll see you guys all on the next video.